Hello everyone, welcome to this channel. Today is November 28th, 2022. The Lord titled this word, Dream World. And the scripture he gave me is 1 Corinthians 4, verses 10 through 14, which read, We are fools for Christ's sake, but ye are wise in Christ. We are weak, but ye are strong. Ye are honorable, but we are despised. Even unto this present hour we both hunger and thirst and are naked and are buffeted and have no certain dwelling place and labor, working with our own hands, being reviled, we bless, being persecuted, we suffer it. Being defamed, we entreat. We are made as the filth of the world and are the off-scouring of all things unto this day. I write not these things to shame you, but as my beloved sons, I warn you. And this is the word. My son, the majority of my body are living in a dream world, shaped by the lies of false teachers, lying prophets, and misguided pastors. My body has been taught that they will never go through the fire of testing. My body has been taught to believe that all the persecutions will happen in another land. And for sure, it will not come to America, since America is blessed because the Christians love the Jewish people and land, so nothing will ever happen here. They have been taught to believe that they are special, and I am going to take them away to heaven. Therefore, there is no need to prepare for anything. Thus saith the Lord, I would not bring you anywhere near my kingdom in the condition you are in. Repent now. My son, shout to the deaf, dumb, and blind people who call themselves Christians. You are full of sin, and many are not even saved. My body, you are full of division and have fallen for every heresy that presents itself. You have called me a liar when you come against my watchmen, whom I have sent to warn you. My son, in this dream world they live in, is about to be shaken to its very core. I have said that the tribulation has started, and yet you doubt because it doesn't line up with the lies you have been taught. Repent now. How do you think the children of Israel felt when Jeremiah told them that the city would be overthrown, the temple would be burnt to the ground, and most of the people would be killed or taken captive? This is how they felt. They threw my true prophet in a sewer prison. They beat him, cursed him, and tried to kill him. Why? Because my people believe the lies of the false prophets. Today, the false prophets have big followings, nice mansions, many cars, nice clothes with expensive jewelry. My body believes them and their lies over my true prophets who seek me in solitude. My son, this dream world that my body caresses is about to collapse. And as my word says, many will fall away from the faith. My remnant, those will be the ones that will persecute you the worst, even unto death. But my remnant, you will be mighty. No, mightier than those in the beginning. So go ahead, my body. Live in your dream world because soon you will be in my world. I say this not to bring fear unto you, but for you to open your eyes, unblock your ears, and prepare for my soon return. My children, your dream world is about to be rocked by my rock, and your fantasies of no persecution will dissolve. I tell you now, I tell you now, persecution is coming to all who are truly mine, but fear not, for I am with you, holding your hand as the tormentors torment you. My son continue to shout the warnings for my body to wake up. Many will not see until the destruction, but many will heed the warnings and prepare, and prepare their families and friends. I said I am coming soon, but not soon enough for those who are living in a dream world. Seek me first and I will add unto you wisdom and knowledge. You will be a strong tower because I have, you have trusted in me and not in a man. Stay in prayer always, and I will hear you. 
Stay in my word, and I will give you strength. I love you all. Leave the dream world and come to the real world. Lord Jesus. As always, please take this word to the Lord in prayer for confirmation. Thank you for subscribing to this channel. Please like and share if led by the Lord to do so. Please see the description box for the transcript of this word. Thank you, and God bless you. Bye for now.